This is an unboxing video. Can you guess what it is? You probably can. It's a belt. Now it came in, it, it didn't come in a box as such. It came in this clear plastic um, packet and then it came in a um, bubble wrap packet. And I couldn't, um, well I'd ordered loads all at once and loads of alarm parts came at once. So I couldn't leave it in that packet because I wouldn't know the unboxing I was doing. I'd have to... <laughs> because I'd be ripping it open and it would be the first time I saw it as well so I wouldn't know what it was, if that makes sense so I had to open it beforehand but um, yeah it's a bell so whoa um, it's not the best of bells it's made in China it had a sticker on over the screw and there goes a the tripod, that was a good save what? That was a little action film now, that. What a good save that was. It had a little screw. I'm not making any sense. It had a little sticker over that screw. But I wanted to fiddle around with it and take it apart. So that screw I took off and put in there. Um, yeah, you get your two wires that go into a motor. Now, the 12 volt bells, like the Friedland Master Bell and the Friedland Bell Bell and all the bells and, blah, 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 and the bells are bell, 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 bell. There's that many bells, I can't tell. Anyway, all the bells were expensive. This bell was something like £30 on offer at £24, so I got it. I'm going to put it in my Empire Alarms dummy box, dummy um, burglar alarm box, the vented one. There's a demonstrate, well, demonstration, can't demonstrate a dummy box. There's, um, a viewing of it on my YouTube channel, if that's what you want to say. Um, so, yeah, this hasn't really got a proper back plate. It's literally got the hammer, the motor and the hammer and the mechanism to hold it together. And obviously that goes ding, ding, ding. There'll be a demonstration of this on the channel anyway. So, shortest video in the world. Yeah, this, this is a fire alarm bell, but I'm going to be using it in an intruder alarm system. So it is 24 volts, and it'll be running off 12 volts, and it won't be as loud as it should. I wasn't going to fit it to my Empire Alarms dummy bell box in the end, um, but I was walking down the street, and I heard a burglar alarm going off that had an old-fashioned bell in, and it wasn't loud at all, so I thought, sod it, I'll do it. Bye!